Hello everyone. So in this session, we are going to see about up down counter. So basically, up down counter is a combination of both the up as well as down counter. Okay. So how does it behaves? Let us see it in the software. Okay. So here, first of all, I'll make some tags. Okay. So the first tag will be our input pulse tag. Okay. So basically. Uh, here we'll be requiring two input pulse tags, right? So basically one for up as well as one for down. So for input pulse up, okay. And similarly here we'll be requiring one more pulse that is input pulse. down right okay and the third one here i uh, let me change this address as i0.2 okay uh, let me do it i0.2 right now the next one will be our reset okay so this is our reset here what i will do is i will just change it to i0.1 okay In this way, we have taken all the inputs, right? Now we require an output that is LED, okay? LED, right? It will be the output, so I am putting it as Q0.0, okay? In this way, we have taken all the inputs, okay? Now let inputs and outputs, right? Now let me make the logic. So here we are having, okay? Or sorry this is uh, not required here we'll be requiring the mean now what I'll do is I'll take this one okay okay here we'll be requiring one no okay here I will give the addresses i0.0 okay and here we'll be giving addresses output right here we'll be having q0.0 right this will be our output now here what we'll do is uh, this is our down counters input pulse right so what is the address i0.2 okay so this is our down counter input pulse so whenever you activate this one the present value will be changed okay this is our reset okay so this is our reset here right now what i'll do is i'll just give it as let leave it uh, this one will not give okay here i am giving it as five okay in this way we have taken now uh, output for down counter okay so you can take it as another output okay so let me take as one more output mm, this is over let it be led2 right okay so here we'll be having this one as led2 right now see what is going to happen I am just downloading this one now. After downloading, we will be going into the online mode. Okay. After this, what we will do is, I will just go here and monitor. Right. So, let us observe the behavior of this counter. Okay. So, here let me first reset it okay uh, okay 
is it is fine so what are the tags required let me check first okay so let me take all the tags again so let me delete all these tags and then take it again so all the tags will be visible here now okay now let me delete the unwanted tags so these are the unwanted tags okay right so these are the main tags which we will be observing here okay so actually what is happening is let us see what is going to happen in this logic right so here if you observe this is our output right so what will happen first we have given what we have given this preset value as 5 here right so what is going to happen when you are giving the input pulse when the first pulse is given okay so the counter value will increase by 1 okay so this counter value has increased by 1 and see our output is both the outputs are in low state now okay now when you are increasing it by 1 by 1 so when it will reach to 5 the output number q0.0 will be in the high state okay see here when it is reached when it has reached to 5 so the output has in the high state now let us observe now what i will do is i'll increase it by more okay so here if you observe we are increasing it okay so the value is increasing and the output is still is in the high state this is because of the up counter right now what we'll do is i'll just uh, give the pulses to the another input that is the input pulse down okay so here when i will give this input pulse down right so it will again start to run in the negative direction if you observe here we, we were having six right so it has become five now okay now when you are giving more input pulses it will go in the negative direction see here if you are able to observe so when the current value of the counter has decreased okay so when it is less than five the output q0.0 is in the low state actually okay so it will be in the low state until and unless it is five or more than five right now what will happen let us observe here when i am giving this negative pulses or uh, the down counters input pulses so it is basically going in the negative direction so when it will become zero again this led uh, this led number two will be in the high state if you observe okay so if you are able to observe here so now it will become zero okay so if you are able to observe this led led number two is in the high state okay so it will remain in the high state whenever the counter goes in the negative direction okay so when it is in the positive direction let us see what is going to happen again okay so again i am giving the positive pulses now so it has become zero so still it is in high state when it will become one then it will be again in the low state okay here now again i am increasing it okay again and again i am increasing it one by one right so again after five pulses or equal to five pulses the output led led number q0.0 is in the high state okay so in this way this down counter is working right so we can use both the functionalities in the single counter that is what up and down counter right so thank you